An East Tennessee man is scheduled to die in December. David Earl Miller was convicted of killing a woman in South Knoxville in 1981. Those who covered that case described the murder as brutal. Daniel Secton spoke to the first journalist to arrive on the scene the night of that murder. Daniel. Brendan and Beth, David Miller has been on death row longer than any other inmate in Tennessee for a murder committed over 35 years ago. And for a reporter who covered the story, the memories haven't faded. The state's case is a bizarre tale of sex, drugs, and murder. Over 35 years later, Lisa Skinner's memory is still clear. I was on the police beat the night that the murder happened. We were in an unmarked car, so we kept our distance. And when we got there, they there were several police vehicles already there, and they had already found the girl. The scene she arrived on was one of the most gruesome in recent Knoxville history. The body of a mentally handicapped woman found after being stabbed and dragged through a South Knoxville home, then left outside. They did tell us that the girl uh, had lived downtown, had been lured away, and she had a learning disability, and so she probably couldn't even discern that she was in danger. The girl was Lee Standifer, a 23-year-old with the mental capabilities of a 12-year-old. And her convicted killer, David Miller, a 23-year-old originally from Ohio. According to testimonies, Miller murdered Standifer at a minister's home where he lived. That minister would later find Standifer's body. The circumstances hit close to home for Skinner. Before I became a journalist, I worked at a special needs camp as a counselor, Summers. And so it always enrages me when I hear about somebody being preyed upon. Skinner hopes Miller's execution might finally bring closure to Standifer's family. After all these years, what do you think about when you think of the family? I hope the family feels relief that justice has been served. I hope the family remembers their good times with their daughter. And in some people's minds, it'll be over finally. Miller's set to be executed next month. He'll die by lethal injection. Back to you.